the most challenging issue for managing the rights of China and China, for China's management of its own rights is this very beginning stage of China's large-scale overseas investment. If you look at the global scale, China has done a multiple large loan in exchange for infrastructure and energy and resource deals around the world. What we think we can do in Canada, this would be a policy level initiative, is to say, look, if you like to invest in our energy sector and min minerals and other areas, which the Chinese have invested quite a little bit uh, in the past few years, could you do something else in the environment area, in clean technology, in other areas that will benefit not only Canada, but China's own future? I think there are leverages Canada can use, and the Chinese have expressed the willingness of considering investment in other than the energy area. So the market itself would not just do it on its own automatically. The policy level initiative in making these things happen uh, could actually uh, make this uh, a long-term objective, what I call the environment security logic that both countries would like to pursue.